Hi, boys and girls, and welcome to Chapel. My name is Pastor Caressa, and I am so excited that you're joining me for Chapel today. I am a pastor at Covenant Presbyterian Church, and uh, we welcome you to Chapel. We'd love to have you join us on a Sunday morning at 1030 for worship. Today we're going to do chapel and we're going to sing and pray and we're going to hear God's word. And so I invite you to grab anybody that's in your house. Maybe you have some brothers or sisters, moms, dads, grandparents, aunts, uncles, cousins, whoever's there and have them join you in front of um, what you're watching. And that way they can participate in this chapel session with you. It's so wonderful when families can come together and they can pray and sing and listen and learn about God. Friends, our first song is one that I learned when I was right about your age, and it's called Father Abraham, and it has a lot of different movements. So I want you to stand up where you are and get ready to kind of move your arms and your legs. And it goes like this. It says, Father Abraham had many sons, and many sons had Father Abraham. I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord. And then we're going to start moving our right hand, our right arm, okay? And we're going to keep moving that until the next time, and we come around, and then we're going to add our left arm. You can do them at the same time, or you can alternate, right? And then we're going to add our legs one at a time, and then we're going to add our head, and then we're going to add our whole body. So this is going to be a really fun song. So here we go. Father Abraham and many sons. And many sons said, Father Abraham, I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, Father Abraham, and many sons. And many sons said, Father Abraham, I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm, Father Abraham, and many sons. And many sons had Father Abraham. I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm, right leg, Father Abraham, and many sons, and many sons had Father Abraham. I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm, right foot, left foot. Now you got all four going at the same time. Ready? Father Abraham and many sons. And many sons said, Father Abraham, I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm, right foot, left foot. You want to bob your head or do you want to turn? Let's turn our head. Ready? Here we go. Father Abraham and many sons, and many sons said, Father Abraham, I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm, right foot, left foot, shake your head. And how about we just move our whole body? Are you ready? Father Abraham and many sons, and many sons said, Father Abraham, I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm, right foot, left foot. But shake your head, move your body, praise him. Woo, that was a good little workout for Jesus, wasn't it? Oh, that was so fun. I hope you had fun with that. The next song is another really fun song that I learned when I went to camp as a kid. It was a church camp. And I remember we were sitting around a fire pit late at night. Well, it wasn't too late. It's probably 7 o'clock. But we were um, sitting around a campfire, and people were playing music. There were a couple of people playing guitar and lots of people singing. And this is one of the songs that they sang. So I'm going to share it with you. It's a lot of fun, and it moves pretty quickly. Um, but it's, do Lord, oh, do Lord, oh, do remember me. Do Lord, oh, do Lord, oh, do remember me. Do Lord, oh, do Lord, oh, do remember me way beyond the blues. All right, I'm going to say, I've got Jesus as my Savior, you take him to. I've got Jesus as my Savior, you take him to. I've got Jesus as my Savior, you take him to. 
way beyond the blues. And then we start over with Do Lord again, okay? So uh, this is another fun song. So if you're not already standing, stand up and get your hands ready to clap. And I want you to sing Do Lord really loud. Don't scream, but sing it really good and really loud. All right, you ready? Do Lord, oh do Lord, oh do remember me. Do Lord, oh do Lord, oh do remember me. Do Lord, oh do Lord, oh do remember me. Way beyond the blues. I've got Jesus as my Savior, you take him too. I've got Jesus as my Savior, you take him too. I've got Jesus as my Savior, you take him too. Way beyond the blues. Do Lord, oh do Lord, oh do remember me. Do Lord, oh do Lord, oh do remember me. Do Lord, oh do Lord, oh do remember me. Way beyond the blues. Amen. Wonderful, wonderful singing. God is smiling from above. Love it. Well, friends, let's go ahead and have a seat. You can sit on your pockets, crisscross applesauce, and we're going to get ready to hear one of God's stories that is found in the Bible. Today is the day of Pentecost when we remember how God gave us the gift of the Holy Spirit so we can say and do the wonderful things that Jesus did. It happened after Jesus went away. The people of God were in Jerusalem to celebrate the great Thanksgiving feast called Pentecost. They came from every country. Jesus' friends were in Jerusalem, too. They were still waiting for the gift of the, the God promised to send the gift of the Holy Spirit. Suddenly, a sound like a mighty wind filled the whole room. In what looked like flames of fire came to the rest of them. All were filled with the Holy Spirit. They were so excited, they began to tell the amazing things God did. They told about Jesus and that God raised Jesus from the dead. They, the people from all the different countries, could understand them. They heard them speak in their own language. What should we do, they asked, Peter said. Change your ways to be baptized so you will be washed clean and new, and you will receive the Holy Spirit. God's promise is for you and for your children and for everyone God calls. Boys and girls, I hope you learned a lot from that story, one of God's stories found in the Bible. We are so blessed to have the Bible because it teaches us so much about God, about Jesus, and about how God wants us to live our lives. So I encourage you to sit with your family and to read some of the stories that are found in the Bible. Read them together. Talk about them. Um, watch these chapels together and just learn more about God. And in doing so, you learn more about yourself and about how we are to treat others, to love with kindness and gentleness and lots of patience. And because each person is a precious child of God. Well, friends, it is time for us to go to God in prayer. We're going to talk to God. We're going to pray to God. So I invite you to fold your hands, or you can do this, or you can do this, or you can even do this, whatever you feel like doing. I'm going to do this today. And we're going to fold our hands, and we're going to sing our prayer song, God is So Good. And then we're going to say a little prayer, and I'm going to say part of the prayer, and you repeat after me. All right, here we go. 
God is so good. God is so good. God is so good. He's so good to me. I love him so. I love him so. I love him so. He's so good to me. God answers prayers. God answers prayers. God answers prayers. He's so good to me. Now repeat after me. Dear God, thank you for your love that we see and know in Jesus. Thank you for taking care of us. Thank you for our families and friends. Thank you for teaching us how to treat others, how to be kind, how to be patient, and how to serve you, God, while serving others. God, always be with me and keep me safe. And all of God's children said, Amen. Wonderful job talking to God. That's what prayer is, talking to God. Well, here in our chapel sessions, we'd love to end chapel by a song called Walking with Jesus. I want you to stand up where you are. We're going to get our walking hands and our walking feet ready to sing this song as we close our time together. Here we go. Ready? Walking with Jesus, walking every day, walking all the way. Walking with Jesus, walking with Jesus alone. Sing it a little louder. Walking with Jesus, walking every day, walking all the way. Walking with Jesus, walking with Jesus alone. Friends, have a wonderful day and thank you so much for joining me in chapel today. Praise God in all that you do, in all that you say, and especially how you treat others. Friends, may God's grace, love, and peace go with you. Amen.